Hi there everyone, this is James, the local Viking. In today's video we're going to go over a few different ways to look up a Google Maps listing through local Viking. So we can either go to a live or scheduled search and we see we have four different methods. Google search, map URL, place ID, and my Google My Business. Google search is simply just typing in a listing that you're looking uh, looking for. Uh, for our demo we're going to use Ruby on Rails. So Ruby on Rails. We can see it has popped up. Sultant. And it would give us the foundation for us to make a geogrid. The second method is by map URL. So if we go to our listing in Google Maps. Oops. If we go to our listing in Google Maps, it's simply just this long URL up top. Bring that to the map URL section. Press enter. And we can see once again it generated the foundation for us to make a geogrid. The third method is place ID. There's a few different ways to look up a place ID. So if we go to oops, we're going to do a search for our knowledge graph just in Google search. You can do so by either searching your business name or name and address and it should pop. You will right click write a review go to inspect. From here you're going to see PID, which is going to be your place ID. Copy and paste that in. And once again, it populates the foundation for you to make a geogrid. If you don't like um, exploring the source code, you can also download an awesome little add-on called, called um, GatherUp. What GatherUp does is, whenever you're on any knowledge graph or Google Map listing, you simply click the GatherUp button, and it's going to generate you a map URL and a review link. In that review link is always going to be your place ID, which you can then copy paste into Local Viking. The last way you can look up listings is if you control the listing in Local Viking, it's going to give you an awesome little drop down here, and you can simply select the listing to then make the geogrid. These are the four methods of looking up Google My Business listings. If there's any other questions or concerns, please reach out to customer support, and I hope you have an awesome day. See you in your next video.